guys, welcome back to the Fashion Stop. So this is going to be a Style Shop video and it's going to be a special one because it's going to be the one that I'm wearing to my very first Nordstrom VP Fashion Board meeting and if you guys watched my vlog number two video, um, the one where I had like exciting news, I think it was titled vlog number two exciting news or something like that, um, I'll try to link it. Anyways, um, I announced that I was applying to be, or I had applied to be a member, and I got in, so I'm super, super, super excited and grateful, and I'm just unbelievably, like, I almost had a heart attack when I found out that I got in. Um, I have my letter here and everything, so it's official, but, um, yeah, I thought I would show you guys the makeup that I would totally wear and, um, the outfit, so, yeah. I love planning for things like this, like when I have exciting places to go, I love just rummaging through my closet and seeing what I can put together to kind of create a whole new look for myself. Um, so yeah, it's really important because it's kind of like the first impression. All the girls that are in the meeting are going to be there, so I really want to make a good impression. Um, hopefully I made one on my interview day, which was where I got to meet like four other girls, but this time it's going to be a little bigger because more people are going to be there, obviously. It's going to be the very first meeting, so it's like the best of the best are going to be there. So I'm super excited to see all the people that I met at my interview and to meet some new people. So I thought I would show you guys. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy, and if you have an internship or an interview or a summer job, anything like that, anything exciting like a college interview, <clears throat> Hopefully this is something that you could put together for yourself or put your own spin on it just to give you some inspiration because I love doing these style self videos. I think they're so, so awesome. Um, I know that when I watch these videos from other fashion gurus or beauty gurus here on YouTube, <clears throat> I find them so helpful. It just helps me to kind of visualize something that I could put together using things I already have in my closet or things I would like to buy. So yeah, hopefully this is helpful for you and informative, but we're going to go ahead and get started with the makeup. Um, I have a full nude lipstick on from Revlon. This is Just Enough Buff. And it's kind of like a nudie peach, which is really pretty. And then I have on Max Lip Gloss in Fold and Tuck, which is literally the brightest coral ever. It's so pretty. So that are my lips. I love glossy lips in the summer. So yeah, that's what I have on. For my brows, I just put some brow gel in it. My, they're really full already, so I don't like to fill them in just because I find that can be a little harsh just for daytime. For my cheeks, I just have my NYX blush in. Oh, I can't even find it. Where did I put it? Oh, here it is. Found it. My NYX blush in mosaic, or my NYX mosaic powder in spice. I know my hair is really messy right now. I apologize. This is what it looks like. It's really pretty. I kind of fell in love with my NYX peach. I literally only have like four blushes, but I love this one and my other one so much that I... Well, if I love a blush, I'll literally just use that blush for like a week straight and then I'll get tired of it and move on to my next one. But I never like wear one blush one day and then the next day wear another blush. That's just how I am. When I love something, I want to wear it all the time, which is a problem. But this is the color. It's really pretty. It's like a mix of cinnamon browns and this really pretty baby pink and a little bit of a brighter pink. So it just comes out to be a really pretty kind of rosy color, which is on my cheeks right now. And then I actually have this color, the baby pink color. It's like a pearl color. So I have that as my highlight in the inner corner. For my eyes, I did my MAC Next to Nothing eyeshadow, which is like a bone shimmery frost color all over the lids. And then for the outer corner, I did kind of a warm brown, almost like MAC texture. That sort of reminds me of a little bit like a reddish brown, which is just my bronzer color. And I put that in the inner corner. I thought it was really pretty. It looked awesome. Hopefully it does. Um, and then just some mascara. I don't like to wear eyeliner, as you guys know. And that's pretty much everything I did for the makeup. And then, of course, I just did my regular face routine, which is um, Lancome Photogenic Concealer and my Mineral 
fail from Bare Minerals. I didn't put any moisturizer on today because my skin gets really oily, especially because the meeting is going to take place in the afternoon. I know it's going to be scorching, so I don't want to put any moisturizer on because my skin is naturally very, very hydrated by itself. So there's no need for that. I literally love my moisturizer, which is a light in the winter, but in the summer, I just kind of skip it, which is automatically okay because my skin is just horrible in the winter. But yeah, okay, moving on to the outfit. That was such a long intro. Oh, hopefully you guys skipped because that was just really annoying. Okay, my hair, obviously I would not put it like this, but it's just gonna be like that for this video. My watch is my Charming Charlie's Relaxed Rose Gold watch, which you can get in the link below. I think it's like $18, so it's not bad. And it's really good quality, so I give this an A+. My top is from a recent haul, and it's from Forever 21. I got it for $9.22. Um, I've got it on sale. It's really cute. It just has a bow and, like, this fold-over collar. Sleeveless. Really cute for summer. Um, I would just wear a cami under this, but I have a white bra on right now, so that's cool. And then I have this A-line um, kind of cotton material, royal blue, purple, Elastic waist skirt from Old Navy, which was really inexpensive. Actually, I think it was like around $15, $16 as well. But really, really pretty and lightweight. Everything is like lightweight in this outfit because it's going to be scorching hot. So I didn't want to wear too many fabrics. I kind of made that mistake in my interview because I didn't listen to my mother. What's new? Okay, for my shoes. Sorry, I had to go back here. I'm just going to wear my Tommy Hilfiger T-strap sandals with snake skin print and this logo. I wear those like literally every day because I love them. Nail polish, turquoise and cake goes by Essie and this mint trying glaze nail polish on the accent nails which I don't remember what it's called but after like five days it's just starting to chip so I love these nail polishes and how long they last. And I have Sally Hansen is to dry clearly quick top coat on top of it. It's not a top coat but it's just like a clear nail polish and I really love it. It works really well as a top coat even though it doesn't market itself as a top coat. Anyways, so yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I wanted it to make it super quick but obviously it wasn't. So I'm just going to say bye now and wish me luck on my first meeting and maybe I can bring my little camera in and just record some snippets and put it in a vlog for you guys. So yeah, love you girls.